Hey guys, what's up? So tell me show you guys how to, how to connect any um, Fire Stick to a PC or a laptop, guys. This is a very easy and short tutorial. So first off, um, you guys want to buy this right here. It's an HD video capture. I think it was like 10 bucks. You can just buy it off of Amazon. I'll try to have a link for this down below. If I remember, if not, just search it up. But this is the one you guys want to get. And this is um, this will allow you to pretty much connect it. So uh, big issue what a lot of people do um, is that if you have, when you have your Fire Stick right here, right? This is the Fire Stick, and this is actually the uh, device right here. So that's the HD um, video uh, capture, and then um, it comes with this like little uh, adapter part right here, so you can use this. We don't have to. Um, we already have one attached to the Fire Stick, so that's fine. It's good enough. I know my computer's going crazy. I don't know why it's it's like heating up so bad, um, but I'm gonna show you guys. So if you actually just connect the Fire Stick to your um, computer, it's actually like an output only. So that's why like this won't work. That's why you need this the HD video capture, um, because if you just connect your Fire Stick directly to your computer, it's output only, so it's not gonna connect. That's why you need this little extension right here. So like I say, you buy from like Amazon for like ten bucks. It's not a big deal. And then I Prime, so it got to me in like a day, a day or two. It came here, so it wasn't that bad at all. But yeah, so once you guys have this um, device right here, once you guys buy this, all you wanna do is connect it to your Fire Stick, and then all you wanna do is make sure you have your Fire Stick connected to like your um, your power source just like you would be like on your tv and once that's connected you can then plug in this us you know hdmi part to the the uh hd video capture device and then just plug this into your laptop and then once you guys plug into your laptop i'm going to show you on the rest of the guide on the computer so we're going to plug this in so one of the annoying things i did find about this um it's not too big a deal but both of my uh, USB cor uh, ports are right next to each other, so it's actually very thick, as you can see. So I, I can't even connect my the one for my mouse right here. It's it's so thick, it, it, I can't connect it in here. So that's a little annoying, but it's not the end of the world. So I'm gonna show you guys the rest on the computer. All right, guys. So I'm gonna show you the quick tutorial. Um, once we're over on the computer, you guys can head over to Microsoft Edge or Google Chrome, and then you guys can um, just search up OBS, you know, Studio Download or whatever. But this is the website it should come up, obsproject.com. And then once you guys are here, uh, depending on what device you have, so if you have Windows or Mac or Linux, just click onto it, and then um, sports Windows 10 and 11, sports Mac OS 11.0 or newer. And this is for Linux, so just click on whatever one you guys have. And then it will actually start the uh, download process. And then after you guys download OBS Studio, all you then want to do is just open up OBS Studio. And then once you guys open up OBS Studio, you can actually click on here to click on like a new scene. And then once you guys click on your new scene, um, you want to click on, I named the Fire Stick, you want to name your scene. And then um, when you actually click on here, all you want to do is go to device and then click on USB video. Again, more like the the biggest cause of this not coming up. So if you just see integrated camera, it's because you don't have that extension. So like I said, if you connect your Fire Stick directly to your computer, this won't come up. You you need that extension. But once you have this here, click on USB video and then click on OK, and then connect your Fire Stick, you know, to the that um, HD video capture device, and then connect it to your computer, and then you know, make sure your your Fire Stick is connected to a power source. Uh, and then that's it. This will come up. And then all you guys want to do to get the volume, if the volume's not, if you don't hear the volume from your Fire Stick, all you want to do is go over to down here. You click on these three dots. Go to Advanced Audio Properties. And then you actually can go to here. And just click on here and click on Monitor and Output. And that's it. And that's really it, guys. And then you should be all good. I mean, you could double click here. And then uh, you do have some options here you guys can customize with and all that. But uh, for the most part, that's really it. And then you guys can get your um, Fire Stick remote and then just, you know, control it. And then, um, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it, guys. It's that easy to do. All right, and then we guys to go over to view and then go over to full screen. And we have it right here. All right, and the last thing I'll show you is how to get this full screen. So you want to right click over here. And then click on full screen projector preview. And then click on right here. And that's how you guys get the device full screen. And it's that easy, guys. If you want to get out of it, just click on escape. And then it'll bring you back here. So, yeah, guys, thanks so much for watching. Hope this video was helpful. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.